Don't go. Hi. <laughs> Got my hair in there. Um, today we're doing Jersey Mike's and I'm really excited for multiple reasons. I'll get into it. My car smells so good. I'm just going to start eating. Okay, we, I, we, I got, um, Mike's Famous Philly. I love a Philly cheesesteak. I know I'm probably going to feel like ass after this, but bitch, so good. And, okay, here's the number one reason why I'm so excited. Not just because Danny DeVito is, like, their spokesperson, but because I got a $130 gift card as a tip to Jersey Mike's like two days ago for no reason. And I was like, hell yeah. So first bite, I'll, I'll get the crinkles out of here. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. I'm really pumped. Peppers, uh, onions, meat, cheese. Hell yeah. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Some something weird was in there. Um, this is incredible. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's nothing better than just like a sandwich. Okay? Nothing better. Now that it's nice out, all I want are just sandwiches, chips, pop. I want to sit on a patio. Yeah. Um... If I look like shit, it's because there's smoke in the air from freaking Canada. And I have sensitive little stupid baby eyes. I've been outside too much. Like, just another reason for me to not go outside. There's freaking smoke in the air. And my eyes hurt. I'm wearing my glasses today, so you really, like, can't see my eyes. Sorry about the glare, but, bitch, I look terrible. Um, I also got salt and vinegar chips, because I'm one of those bitches that likes salt and vinegar chips. <laughs> you know? Um, let me have some chips. Mmm. I don't understand why people don't like salt and vinegar chips. They they make me feel stuff, you know? They make me feel something. Mm. Wow. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put a chip on the sandwich. There, we'll put it that way. Mm-hmm. Holy shit. Um, so I've been watching The Sopranos also, and that's why I wanted to get Jersey Mike's and a Gabagool. Why don't they have a Gabagool um, sub at Jersey Mike's, a sandwich? Just saying. I would order the Gabagool. Every time. Mm. But yeah, I'm on um, season three already of The Sopranos. And nobody spoil it, please. I really like it. Um, I'm at the part where... Spoilers, if you haven't seen it. Um... I feel bad, weird saying this, but Uncle Pussy um, just got whacked for being a rat.
That's where I am. Nobody say anything else. Okay, please. I'm trying to bust through it because now that I'm watching it and I've been talking about it to every person in my life about how good the Sopranos are or is, um, it's been coming up on my feed. All these freaking spoilers. And I'm like, no, no. If it gets spoiled and ruined, I will be very upset. Mm. Sorry, I'm trying to get this open with one hand. Hell yeah. Don't know if you could hear that. Car's making weird sounds. Um, I saw the Northern Lights yesterday. What? So that was like actually really cool. Um, this weekend was Mother's Day and if you work in the service industry, you know it is the most chaotic, busiest time of the year. <laughs> Always. And this whole week has kicked my ass at work. I'm exhausted. We had a wedding. It was men's night. I was outside for like 14 hours one day. Outside! <laughs> um, anyways, I was leaving work really late on Saturday. We had a big ass wedding and I knew in the morning we had Mother's Day and it's a Mother's Day brunch. We have like three, 400 people coming in. It's, excuse me, a mess. And I saw the Northern lights in the sky on my drive home at about midnight. And I was just driving along. I mean, I really wasn't even paying attention to the road. I was just like staring off. It was incredible, okay. I should have got out and taken pictures, but every person in my life ha uh, took pictures. So I, I can find pictures if I want to. But anyways, that really made my whole night this weekend. Shout out to anyone in the service industry right now. Are you feeling it? I feel like I got literally hit by a bus. Everything's broken in my body, including my brain. I'm just fucked up. Sorry. Look at this sandwich. Can it focus? Oh, it's so good, you guys. Go to Jer Jersey Mike's. Gabagool. This is amazing. Woke up this morning, got some gabagool. Is that offensive? Like, the more I watch Sopranos, they talk about, like, how Italian-Americans <clears throat> have been oppressed. And I always make, like, gabagool jokes and do this. And I, I hope it's not offensive. I am so sorry if it is. And I will stop if someone tells me it is. I just love, who doesn't love saying gabagool? Mm. 
How did Jersey Mike's get Danny DeVito as their spokesperson is what I want to know. Because, like, that's really the only reason I would ever go to Jersey Mike's. I'm just saying. And Danny DeVito could shit on a piece of bread, sell it for $500, and he'd have people lining up out the door. And I might be one of those people. Uh, no, never mind. <laughs> um, I can't girl boss without my fucking coffee. Wow. I finished Daisy Jones and the Six. And, you know, I was so surprised at how much I really liked this. Because it is not my normal style of book. At all. If you've seen any of my book reviews, I want... I like the horror community. I love disturbing, horrible books, okay? Like... One of my all-time favorite books is American Psycho. And that just to like tell you kind of what I like to read, okay? That's like a good base. I love books like that where it's kind of like a psychological thriller. This is just like a feel-good kind of book. And I really loved it. And I read it not because like I wanted to. It's weird. So I was pet sitting somewhere. I didn't bring a book with me and they had this on the shelf and I like to read before bed. It makes me really tired. So I picked it up and I was hooked instantly. It basically follows Daisy Jones, this chick and the six, which is another band. And it's like, well, excuse me. You read it as if you're watching like a VH1 behind the music uh, episode. Like, it's, it, it's really engaging. It paints a really awesome visual. I don't know. And it ends kind of weird. Like, it keeps you wanting more. So, I'm going to watch the show. I think it's on Hulu, maybe? I don't know. It's on one of the things. And I highly recommend that book. Whew, I'm sweating. Holy shit. Okay, I have like one bite left. I'll shut up and I'll go. Daisy Jones and the Six, read it. It's a good book. It's feel good. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That was so, so good. Now that I have a $130 gift card, all my mukbangs might just be Jersey Mike. Should I just try the whole Jersey Mike menu? Let me know. Okay, holy shit balls. 
Danny DeVito, if you're watching, great job. Thank you. Incredible. Okay, I love you. <laughs> okay, bye.